The first couple of days, I was really good at tracking my energy. I remembered like twice a day to check in and be like, okay, how am I feeling? How did I sleep? But after I would say the first three days, I really just kind of forgot about it until you would remind me of it in those messages. Thank you for that. I found it really hard to carve out the time to check in with myself and write down how I'm feeling. Okay, I appreciate the transparency. Our first call two weeks ago, we had talked about what can affect your natural energy cycles from the moon, your period, the people you're hanging out with, and how much you're putting on your plate in your business and in your life. So what we're really trying to do here to get you to consistent 30K months is have you understand when your ups come, when your downs come, and how we can improve those through your lifestyle and your mindset. And it says here in your onboarding information that you really want to grow your social media, have more time at home with your family. So to do those things, we gotta figure out where your time and your focus and your energy are going. Okay, I know you say it's important and I've seen your transformation and I've seen the transformation of your other clients, so I'm gonna buckle down and do it. But do you think maybe you could remind me to check in on my energy throughout the day? Perhaps, maybe? Of course I can check in with you throughout the day. That's my favorite thing to do. So I'm gonna set an alarm on my phone for 10 a.m. and 5 p.m. your time. Does that work? That would be awesome. OMG, I'm so glad I found you. I've never worked with a coach that could provide me this level of support to really keep me on track. Because I swear I know so much, but making the things happen is so hard to do. No, I'm happy to do it. All right, let's dive into our topic today because today we're talking about how to go from a victim mindset to a growth mindset.